Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this session, we will discuss about how IR microcontroller can be used to control LED lights and LCD panel using microbit version 2 board. We know that IR remote control is used for controlling home appliances like television, washing machine, air conditioning, etc. For this project, I need several components. This is the IR remote control and then there is a receiver. So this acts as a transmitter, sends IR signal. The wavelength of IR signal is much above the visible light spectrum. Therefore, the light transmitted by IR LED will not be visible. This is the IR receiver which has a photodiode. The transmission distance between these two will be up to 8 meters and the effective angle is 60 degrees. I'm going to use microbit version 2 board and that is connected to key studio microbit shield these are the output devices i have 1602 lcd panel with i square ski module fitted onto it and the two led modules this is the ir receiver and signal pin that is white wire is connected to p0 then red for the positive supply, that is V1, and brown for the negative of the power supply, so that is ground. So this module requires 5 volt. Now white light LED, yellow, which is a signal pin connected to P2, and red and black for the supply. So we can use V1 or V2. I'm using V2 here. So red is connected to V2 and black is connected to ground. Now, similarly, for the red LED, I'm going to use P9 pin that is connected to yellow wire, which is signal pin, then red and brown for the power supply. So V2 I use. So red is connected to V2 and uh, brown is connected to ground. All these three modules work with 5 volt. This is the 1602 I2C module, which has a blue potentiometer to adjust the contrast of LCD. It has got four wires and Key Studio Shield also has a separate port with four wires. Now, this one gray for the ground and a red wire for the supply, that is V. Then we have serial clock pin which is yellow so that is pin number 19 so then gray which is serial data pin to pin number 20 so this is the connection now what output we expect is when we press button 1 this should display digit 1 white led will be on and lcd screen will display a message saying white LED is on. When we press button 2, then micro bit will display 2, red LED will be on and this will display a message saying red LED is on. When we press any other key other than 1 and 2, this displays the icon which is shown here and both the LEDs are turned off and we get a message LEDs are off. So this is what we expect. Programming the micro bit, I'll be using Microsoft Make Code software. The first you need to create a new project. Let me give the name as IR micro bit. Once you launch the project, you will come to this particular page. So this is the library where you will find different blocks to work with IR remote control and LCD. You need to have two additional modules. In order to import them, you can click extensions and search for LCD and you will find this particular block. So you click here and import them. And you also need an additional module called IR. So this is the module. Once you have all these modules, so now you can start making a block diagram. Right now I need this on start block. So this is not required. I'll remove it. Let me check the IR module. In the IR module, you will find 
all these blocks. So this is the first block where you configure your pin for receiving the IR signal from the IR remote control. So I need this block. I'll just pick and drop it here. I also need to initialize the LCD address. So this block is required. And the address is 27H, which is equal to 39 in decimal. To turn off the output LEDs, I need to write a digital signal 0 to pin 2 and pin 9. Now, when any IR button is pressed, I need to perform some task. So I'll just pick and drop this. The value of the button press will be stored in a variable called as IR button. And I need to compare it with either 1, 2 or some other number. I need a if statement block and that you will find under logic. So you can pick and drop this. I also need a comparison block to compare IR button with different numbers. I need a comparison block that also you will find under logic. So I'll pick and drop it here. So you can find IR button over here. Value of button 1 is 104. I need to compare it to 104. If it is equal to button 1 whose value is 104, then I can show a number 1 on microbit LED display. Along with that, I also have to write logic 1 at pin 2. So I need this block. So this is pin 2 and I will write 1. I also have to display a string on the LCD saying white LED is on. So I'll click here, show string. String will be white LED is on. Starting at X and Y. So Y can be 0 or 1. This corresponds to rows. So 1602 will have 16 characters and 2 rows. Before displaying this string, I'll make sure that the LCD is cleared. I'll pick and drop this. So this will happen when the button 1 is pressed, whose code is 104. If IR button pressed is 2, I need to perform some other task. So I need a comparison statement so that I can find here. So I need to compare the IR button value with 152, which is a code for button 2. You go to IR module, IR button, which is a variable, and compare it with 152. 152 is a code for button 2. So if it is equal to that, then I can show the number 2 on microbit LED display. And I will write 1 at pin 2, pin, sorry, pin 9. Then I will write digital value 1 to pin 9 that will turn on red LED. Then I will display a string saying red LED is on. And before that, I'll make sure that the LCD is cleared. If any other button is pressed other than 1 and 2, then I can show, let's say, some other icon, let's say this icon. So 
So I need this block P2, 0, and copy and paste P9, 0. And I will display a string saying LEDs are off. I will turn off both the and LEDs. Before that, let me clear the LCD. So this is going to be my program. Once the program is complete, you can download.